Pluto forces them to ascend and descend as its orbit crosses the path of another planet at the far reaches of our local planetary system. Pluto, the perplexing little planet, is generating a lot of excitement in the field of space science. Recent developments suggest that Pluto could potentially collide with Neptune, causing unease among astronomers and space enthusiasts. Well-known figures like Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku have raised alarms about the possible consequences of this celestial encounter. But how did Pluto end up on a collision course with its neighboring planet? Furthermore, what could this cosmic clash imply for life on Earth? Join us as we explore how Pluto's orbit is intersecting with Neptune and why this anomaly is leaving scientists concerned. Once considered a clear planet, Pluto underwent a reclassification and is now referred to as a dwarf planet due to its atypical orbit. Despite this demotion, Pluto continues to captivate and intrigue the astronomical community. Recently, concerns have been raised by esteemed scientists such as Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku regarding Pluto's path, which may bring it into closer proximity with Neptune. This alignment suggests a series of potential interactions between these two majestic celestial bodies, with significant implications for Earth. Pluto's orbit around the Sun is unique, setting it apart within our solar system. Its orbit is notably elongated, crossing great distances as it travels. Since its discovery in 1930, Pluto has yet to complete a full revolution around the Sun, which adds to its mystique. Unlike the more circular orbits of the major planets, Pluto's orbit is unusually stretched, making it a distinctive feature in our solar neighborhood. The tilt of Pluto's orbit is another fascinating aspect, deviating 17 degrees from the ecliptic plane, giving it a sharper angle than the orbits of other planets. This combination of inclination and elongated orbit adds layers of complexity to Pluto's movement around the Sun. One particularly intriguing characteristic is its periodic interaction with Neptune's orbit. For around 20 years in each cycle, Pluto's orbit takes it closer to the Sun than Neptune's, defying expectations given the separate locations of these two planets. Notably, Pluto's orbit is not circular but oval-shaped, leading to significant fluctuations in its distance from the Sun. At its closest approach, Pluto reaches about 30 astronomical units AU from the Sun, while at its farthest point, it stretches out to over 49 Australian dollars, nearly double the distance of Neptune from the Sun. Furthermore, Pluto's orbit is tilted at a critical angle relative to the major planets, contributing to the intricacy of its path and interactions with other celestial bodies, particularly Neptune. When Pluto and Neptune do meet in their orbits, their gravitational forces alter their trajectories over time. This complicated relationship highlights the interconnectedness of celestial bodies, with each object exerting gravitational influence over the others, shaping their orbits. In recent years, advancements in observational technology have enabled astronomers to track Pluto's path with remarkable precision, offering deeper insights into its orbit and potential impact on the stability of the outer solar system. While a direct collision between Pluto and Neptune remains unlikely, the possibility cannot be completely ruled out, prompting increased interest and scrutiny from the astronomical community. Despite its small size and distant location, Pluto continues to command attention. So why hasn't a collision occurred between Pluto and Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational interactions between planets. As soon as astronomers began studying Pluto's orbit, they were baffled by its strange behavior. Unlike most planets, which maintain a consistent plane as they orbit the Sun, the ecliptic plane, Pluto's path deviates sharply, creating an additional layer of mystery. The real puzzle arose when scientists realized that Pluto's orbit intersects with Neptune's path. Yet, despite this unusual overlap, Pluto's orbit remains stable, which speaks to the complex mechanics of space. Understanding how celestial bodies like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun interact gravitationally is a significant challenge for astronomy. Predicting the movement of these bodies is akin to determining where they will be based on their starting positions and the forces they exert on one another. For Pluto, the interaction between its orbit, Neptune's orbit, and the Sun's gravitational pull creates a delicate and coordinated system that allows Pluto's path to remain predictable. Terms such as precession, libration, and VSOP, variations seculaires de orbits planetaires, Variations help researchers navigate these complex dynamics. Understanding these principles is vital for maintaining the stability of planetary orbits. When Pluto crosses Neptune's path, it is still about 90 degrees away, preventing a direct collision. The phenomenon of libration ensures that Pluto remains safely out of Neptune's path even when it approaches. The VSOP variations, named after researchers von Zeipel, 
Poincaré, and others, explain why Pluto's orbit may seem irregular but remains predictable over time. Despite the apparent chaos of space, certain patterns and rules help keep objects in orbit. These principles work to stabilize Pluto's orbit, mitigating the risk of a collision with Neptune. The chance of orbital chaos highlights how sensitive a celestial body's orbit is to its starting conditions. Even small changes in a planet's position or velocity can lead to major shifts in its path over time. Using complex computational simulations, astronomers can model Pluto's movement in space, observing how slight adjustments in variables can dramatically alter its orbit. In the late 20th century, these simulations revealed that Pluto's orbit, while seemingly stable, can be subject to chaotic fluctuations. Even minor differences in Pluto's initial position or speed can lead to significant changes over long periods. Nevertheless, Pluto's orbit has remained largely stable over billions of years, suggesting that, despite its apparent turbulence, its movement follows a discernible pattern. However, predicting the behavior of planets with such eccentric orbits is a difficult task. These systems are so unpredictable that long-term forecasting becomes a challenge. Simulations are useful in estimating possible outcomes, but they also demonstrate the inherent unpredictability of these celestial movements. Gaining a better understanding of Pluto's orbit is essential, especially when considering whether a collision with. Clear indication that there's much more to discover. He finds the mystery of space fascinating and believes that events like Pluto's renaming engage the public in the pursuit of space science. Tyson works alongside other researchers to warn about the potential risks of Pluto's orbit, especially its potential collision with Neptune. Tyson suggests that such an impact would be a monumental event for the entire solar system, with consequences that could ripple across the cosmos. A collision between Pluto and Neptune would release massive amounts of energy and could cause Pluto to break apart, sending fragments hurtling through space, potentially colliding with other celestial bodies. Even Neptune would be affected, with its trajectory altered as a result of the impact. Michio Kaku, a well-known theoretical physicist, offers his own perspective on the relationship between celestial mechanics and space exploration. Kaku emphasizes that studying Pluto's orbit can provide critical insights into the future of space exploration. He believes that understanding the intricate gravitational interactions between celestial bodies like Pluto can improve future missions, helping us navigate the solar system more safely and predict potential hazards. Kaku's work in theoretical physics, particularly in string theory, aims to decode the fundamental laws governing the universe. He suggests that by studying the dynamics of celestial bodies like Pluto, we can unlock a deeper understanding of the forces that shape our reality. Both Tyson and Kaku agree that observing events like a potential Pluto-Neptune collision offers an exciting opportunity to learn more about the universe. In particular, such an event could have profound implications for our understanding of string theory. String theory seeks to explain the fundamental forces of nature by modeling the universe as a series of one-dimensional strings. A Pluto-Neptune collision could generate extreme conditions that would provide valuable data for testing string theory predictions about spacetime. While the immediate impact on Earth would be negligible due to our distance from the outer solar system, the scientific knowledge gained from such an event could be transformative. It would expand our understanding of the fundamental nature of the universe pushing the boundaries of theoretical physics and space science. As researchers continue to study the gravitational influences of neighboring planets like Neptune, the dynamic and ever-changing nature of space becomes increasingly evident. However, space remains full of mysteries. The three-body problem, where multiple celestial bodies exert gravitational influences on each other, is just one of the many complexities that scientists are working to solve. The ongoing exploration of space is crucial for broadening our understanding of the universe and the principles that govern it. Although the likelihood of planetary collisions is extremely low, the possibility still exists due to the influence of gravitational forces. These forces can alter the orbits of planets, potentially leading to collisions over time. One example of this phenomenon is the TRAPPIST-1 system, which contains seven Earth-sized planets. The gravitational forces between these planets can create orbital resonances, making their orbits less stable and potentially leading to collisions in the future. Researchers are closely monitoring these systems to better understand how celestial bodies interact and how planetary paths can shift. In addition to planetary interactions, rogue planets, planets that no longer orbit a star, can drift through space. These planets, which were once part of a star system, can travel vast distances and occasionally collide with other star systems. However, 
The vast emptiness of space means that the chance of a rogue planet colliding with another planet is low. Despite their rarity, rogue planets are intriguing objects of study for astronomers. Finally, when galaxies collide, the gravitational forces involved can alter the movement of stars and planets. While planets may not collide directly, their orbits can be disrupted, potentially flinging them out into space or causing them to collide with other planets or their host stars. This disturbance can lead to the creation of new celestial bodies or even the birth of new stars. The disturbance caused by galaxy collisions emphasizes the immense influence of gravitational forces in shaping the cosmos. For instance, when the Milky Way and the Andromeda Galaxy eventually collide, a process estimated to occur billions of years from now, the gravitational interactions between the two galaxies could drastically alter the structure of both systems. Stars, planets, and other celestial objects would be flung into new orbits, potentially forming entirely new systems. Despite this chaos, actual collisions between individual stars or planets within the merging galaxies would remain exceedingly rare due to the vast distances between them. However, the impact of such events on planetary systems could be profound. Disruptions in planetary orbits could lead to planets being ejected from their host stars, turning them into rogue planets, or causing them to collide with other celestial bodies. These galactic encounters serve as reminders of the dynamic and ever-changing nature of the universe, where even large-scale systems are not immune to gravitational upheaval. Returning to the case of Pluto and Neptune, scientists continue to study their complex orbital relationship to better understand how gravitational interactions prevent collisions. The orbital resonance between the two celestial bodies, where their orbital periods are synchronized in a way that prevents close encounters, is a fascinating example of the intricate mechanics that maintain stability in the solar system. In Pluto's case, it completes two orbits around the Sun for every three orbits completed by Neptune. This precise resonance ensures that the two bodies never come too close, despite their overlapping orbital paths. This resonance is a remarkable demonstration of how gravitational forces can maintain order in what might otherwise appear to be a chaotic system. It also underscores the importance of understanding these forces when studying the long-term dynamics of planetary systems. Without such resonances, the orbits of planets and other celestial objects could become unstable over time, potentially leading to collisions or ejections. Beyond the specific case of Pluto and Neptune, the study of orbital resonances has broader implications for understanding the formation and evolution of planetary systems. Similar resonances have been observed in other systems, such as the moons of Jupiter and the planets in the TRAPPIST-1 system. These resonances provide valuable insights into the processes that shape the architecture of planetary systems and the role of gravitational forces in maintaining stability. Looking ahead, the continued exploration of Pluto's orbit and its interactions with Neptune will likely yield new discoveries about the dynamics of the outer solar system. Advances in observational technology, such as more powerful telescopes and space probes, will enable scientists to study these interactions in greater detail. Missions like New Horizons, which provided unprecedented close-up views of Pluto in 2015, have already revolutionized our understanding of this distant dwarf planet. Future missions could uncover even more about Pluto's unique orbit, its relationship with Neptune, and the broader dynamics of the Kuiper Belt, a region of the solar system populated by icy bodies and remnants from its formation. The study of Pluto's orbit also has implications for understanding the potential risks posed by other celestial bodies, such as asteroids and comets, that could intersect with Earth's orbit. By refining our understanding of orbital mechanics and gravitational interactions, scientists can improve their ability to predict and mitigate potential hazards to our planet. This research not only advances our knowledge of the solar system, but also enhances our ability to protect Earth from potential cosmic threats. In the grand scheme of the cosmos, Pluto's eccentric orbit serves as a reminder of the delicate balance that governs the movements of celestial bodies. It highlights the intricate interplay of gravitational forces that shape the solar system and the broader universe. As we continue to study these forces and their effects, we gain a deeper appreciation for the complexity and beauty of the cosmos, as well as our place within it. While the possibility of a collision between Pluto and Neptune remains a topic of scientific curiosity rather than immediate concern, it underscores the importance of continued exploration and observation. The mysteries of space are vast, and each new discovery brings us closer to understanding the fundamental principles that govern the universe. Whether through the study of distant dwarf planets, rogue planets, or galaxy collisions, our quest to unravel the secrets of the cosmos is an ongoing journey, one that promises to reshape our understanding of the universe for generations to come.